Hey everyone, how's it going? So, as you know, I'm a really big appreciator of everybody who's been supporting my channel over the last few months. I love everyone who's subscribed and who's been leaving comments and getting some chats going about movies, that sort of stuff. I really want to say thank you to everyone who's done that. Now, as a way of giving back to you guys, over the years I've been collecting a lot of Blu-rays, DVDs, that sort of thing. Now, I have a massive pile of movies that I want to get rid of. These are movies that I've like had on DVD but upgraded to Blu-ray or for whatever reason I've got a whole bunch of spares. So I was sort of thinking of selling them on eBay or something like that but look to be honest I can't be bothered going through all that and I'm probably not going to get that much for them anyway. So I'm going to have a really big movie giveaway right now. Monkey? What are you doing? You gotta shush. I'm making a video. Cats these days. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna ask you a question in a minute and I want everyone who wants to enter this to drop their answer in the comments below and whoever gets it right, well there's probably gonna be a few people so I'll do a random draw of one person and that person is gonna get to choose five of any of the movies that I'm about to show you now. Seriously, that's all there is to it. You just gotta answer the question and you get to pick five of these movies that I'm now going to go through, so this is probably going to take a little bit of time. I'll try and get through it as quickly as possible because there is a lot to get through. Alright, so starting off we have the original Child's Play. Next up there's a three movie pack of Child's Play 2, 3 and Seed of Chucky, which look, to be honest, I'd probably just include all these in one thing. Then we have Jason X, Hostel Part 2, Final Destination, the first one. The original Scream. I've got two packs of Lethal Weapon, one, two, three, and four, which I'm happy to include as one thing. Deep Impact. The Terminator. 300. Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines. Nyaar. I've got Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers. And we also have Predator, the definitive edition with a slip cover. Nyaar. Next up, we have Spider-Man 2.1, which was Spider-Man 2, but had a bunch of extra features in it. Uh, we have, for a few dollars more, and a fistful of dollars. We have Full Tilt Boogie, which was a documentary about the making of From Dust Till Dawn. It was really, really good. If you're a From Dust Till Dawn fan, highly recommend that. Uh, we have Oceans 13 and Oceans 11. I don't have 12. Ah, next I have a Spider-Man 2 collector's DVD gift set that has a whole bunch of stuff stuff in it. It's got a little comic book that's never been opened. It's got a artist's portfolio book. It's got concept to, to screen portfolio. It's got a bunch of postcards. Uh, all sorts of stuff in there. So that's a pretty neat little box set. Next up we have Minority Report. It'll blow your mind. Then we have on the Tom Cruise theme, Collateral. Great movie. Uh, <laughs> uh, no one's going to want this. Biodome with Paulie Shaw and Stephen Baldwin. I bought this for $2 because for some strange reason I seem to remember liking it back in the 90s or something. And I tried watching it again. <laughs> it is freaking terrible. And I also have a couple of Justice League cartoon movies uh, that I think had like a few episodes of the TV show. This one's got four episodes. I don't know how many this one's got, but hey, Justice League. Woo Continuing on, I have The Naked Gun, the original. The Matrix. Whoa. Uh, we got X-Men 2, two disc special edition. Da -da -da. Jaws! Uh, 30th anniversary edition with a slipcase and stuff. Neat. Uh, Alright, now onto the Blu rays. I have Star Trek. I have Freddy vs. Jason. I have the original Hostel. I have Machete. Uh, we got 
The Hobbit, An Unexpected Journey, uh, which is a Blu-ray DVD combo. Uh, I also have The Hobbit, An Unexpected Journey, the 3D version, which, if you notice, is still in its shrink wrap with the price tag on it. I've never even opened this one, so it's all yours if you want it. Uh, okay, now we're getting into some Region 1 DVDs. So these are American ones that I've got, which if you've got a multi-regional DVD player, you'll be fine, uh, but just keep it in mind. So starting off, we have Slither, which was made by James Gunn, one of my favorite directors of all time. Uh, we have The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. This is a special edition box set that has a couple of discs and it's also got like lobby cards and a booklet and stuff. Uh, so that's pretty neat if you like that. Uh, then I also have Clerks. Uh, okay, this one is actually a British DVD, which, uh, Region 2, uh, this one is the remake of 310 to Yuma with Russell Crowe, Christian Bale, love this movie. Uh, next I have The Crow, which is a two disc special edition. Jason Goes to Hell, The Final Friday, which wasn't The Final Friday. The Aviator with Leonardo DiCaprio, really cool movie. Uh, I've got the Night of the Living Dead. Now, I believe this is the remake from 93, I think, which I really dug. This was actually a really solid remake. And it is still in its shrink wrap. So, there you go. And the last one I have is CB4 in the Mother House. Uh, CB4 is such an awesome parody movie of the gangster rap genre of the 90s. If you haven't seen this, I strongly recommend it. So those are my movies that I'm giving away to you. Like I said, all you need to do is answer this question that I got coming up and then you're going to be able to choose five of anything I just showed you and I will send them out to you. So my question to you is this. In my recent video of my top 10 most favorite movies of all time, three of those 10 movies were based on a book. In other words, they weren't originally a screenplay written for the movie. You need to tell me which of those three movies were originally a book. Simple, right? This question is definitely either suited for film buffs or people who have a little bit of time to do some Googling. So get to it. Leave your answer in the comments below of this video. And like I said, there's probably going to be a few people who get it right. So I'll do a random draw. And also you need to be a subscriber as well. So make sure you subscribe to my channel in order to have a chance of winning. And that's about it. So keep in mind all of these movies as well, even though they're secondhand, I have kept them in absolutely pristine condition. I'm really fussy about all my DVDs and Blu-rays and stuff, and you won't find a speck of dust on any of them they're absolutely in perfect condition so have fun good luck guys and i'm looking forward to picking a winner soon i don't actually know when i'll draw this competition i'll just maybe give it two weeks let's say two weeks from today so i will draw a winner then so best of luck i hope you win drop me some comments because i love to give away movies and i would love to give away movies to you see you next time click subscribe to stay up to date with all the latest movie reviews Skynet will be taking over any day now, so what have you got to lose? Nyaaah!